Welcome to WatchGuard's Daily Security Bite. I'm Corey Nockreiner. Today's story is Leaked ExoBot. ExoAndroid Bot, or just ExoBot, is an Android botnet trojan that infects Android devices through hijacked applications. Once it infects an Android device, it uses overlays to uh, pay attention to whenever you go to a banking site to try to steal your banking credentials. So it's basically Android banking malware. In any case, this week, Bleeping Computer released information sharing that the source code for this big Android botnet has now leaked publicly. They were able to get their their hands on this source code through a, a third party, and then they've also validated that this is real source code through a number of security organizations. So that means it's probably pretty easy for threat actors to get the source code for this pretty powerful Android banking botnet. They no longer have to pay for it, which opens up the possibility that a lot more uh, threat actors will likely use this botnet. So we haven't got our hands on this source code yet and haven't had a chance to analyze it or validate it, but enough uh, legitimate third party uh, security companies have validated it. So what does this mean for Android users? Well, on one hand, not much has changed. Like always, malware tends to get on Android devices when you sideload or you load third-party applications from unsanctioned sources. So for instance, if you're not loading from Google Play. So really, this malware doesn't change that. Just the fact that this botnet has leaked does mean there's more potential threat actors that might try to make malicious applications for Android devices. But in many cases, the attacker still needs you to sideload this malicious application. So as long as long as you mostly just download applications from uh, well-known repositories like Google Play, you should be relatively okay. That said, some of the applications on Google Play have been infected with this type of malware in the past. So you do sometimes have to worry about that, though Google does a decent job of validating their marketplace. Anyways, just wanted to share this leak for any Android users out there. Uh, there's no reason to really say the sky is falling, but do know the fact that there's leaked source code means means that a lot more threat actors may be making malware for Android devices in the short term. That's it for today's story. Thank you for watching.